Hi everyone, I am Shahan Laik. Welcome back to my channel and in this video, I will discuss about Sihan syndrome. So what is Sihan syndrome? Sihan syndrome is postpartum pituitary necrosis. You can see the picture. This is the pituitary gland and after the delivery of the baby, after the partum, it become necrosed and that is known as Sihan syndrome. I will discuss further in this video. So, what is Sihan syndrome? You can see this picture. Sihan syndrome is postpartum pituitary gland necrosis. What does necrosis mean? It means death. It means death of the tissues that are there in the pituitary gland. And this occurs after the partum, postpartum. That means mother who gives birth to infant. That is postpartum. So, after the mother has delivered the infant, then what happens? Necrosis of the pituitary gland occurs. And where does pituitary gland is situated? I already shown you the picture. Pituitary gland is situated at the base of the brain. And this is actually a disorder where the cells of the pituitary gland of a new mother, that means a mother who a, a girl who has become mother newly started to die so this is a disorder in which the cells of the pituitary gland will die in a new mother and why this is occurring because of the excessive blood loss during the childbirth this is very very important because the mother losses a lot of blood during the childbirth then what happens there is a shortage of blood in the pituitary gland the, in the supply of the pituitary gland and that is why the necrosis or death of the pituitary gland tissue occurs and that is known as Sehan syndrome. Always remember Sehan syndrome has the following characteristics. Number one, inability to lactate. These mothers will complain that they cannot properly lactate. Why they cannot properly lactate? This is very important because they are having deficiency of a hormone that is required for lactation that is prolactin. Prolactin deficiency as the pituitary gland is necrosed. So there is a deficiency of prolactin. As there is deficiency of prolactin, these mother cannot lactate. These mother enable to lactate. Let me discuss the other features. Other features are amenorrhea and these patient will always complain of amenorrhea. What does amenorrhea means? Amenorrhea. Menorrhea means the menstrual cycle, the menstrual bleeding that occurs normally in a female and amenorrhea means absence, a means absence of the menstrual bleeding. These patients will complain they are not having the periods, they are not having the pr proper bleeding. Why? Because of the gonadotropin deficiency. Because of the gonadotropin deficiency. These are very important. One, the patient will complain that the patient cannot lactate because of the prolactin deficiency. Number two, the patient cannot menstruate because of of the gonadotropin deficiency gonadotropin deficiency these two hormones are deficient why they are deficient because these hormones are produced in the pituitary gland and the pituitary gland is now necrosed because of the excessive blood loss during the childbirth so the patient is suffering from Sihan syndrome and so the patient cannot lactate properly the patient cannot menorate properly okay and another thing is the skin depigmentation this is very important skin depigmentation you know melanin another thing is skin depigmentation you know that melanin is a pigment which is there inside our skin and this pigment makes the color of our skin. Now when there is Sihan syndrome, when there is necrosis of the pituitary gland, so the melanin pigment is not properly produced and that is why you will get skin depigmentation. That means the pigment will decrease and the coloration of the skin will fade. So that is very important. Number one, inability to lack 
lactate that is due to prolactin deficiency number two is amenorrhea that is gonadotropin deficiency and number three is skin depigmentation these three is very important now you can see this sehan syndrome number one inability to breastfeed that is the breast milk never comes in number two fatigue number two is fatigue the patient will always complain of fatigue and number three is lack of menstrual bleeding which i told you another thing which i i will tell that is loss of the pubic and axillary hairs the hairs in the body that is the pubic hairs the axillary hairs will be lost in this process of pituitary necrosis as the pituitary necrosis occurs so the pubic hairs the axillary hairs all these hairs will be lost from the body and the patient will have loss of axilla and pubic hair another very important is low blood pressure whenever you check the patient's blood pressure bp measurement whenever you do you will find that the patient is having low blood pressure now you will ask me why all these things are occurring all these things are occurring because the mother has given birth to a child and the mother has suffered a lot of blood loss and because of the blood loss pituitary necrosis has occurred and because of the pituitary necrosis you can get these symptoms which are deficiency of prolactin deficiency of gonadotropin the melanin is not properly produced and all these things like skin pigment depigmentation decrease in lactation the mother cannot lactate also the hair loss axillary hair loss and pubic hair loss all these things occur thank you so much for watching this video this is the end of this video if you like this video make a thumbs up and please subscribe our channel because this channel contains many many more than 400 medical videos i have already prepared all these are free you can go to the playlist option of our channel and you can find out videos on medicine i don't know how much is there i think uh, maybe uh, how many is there it may be one more than 100 200 300 400 videos are already on medicine on pathology you can watch a lot of videos you can watch the usmle plab series you can watch videos on covid19 everything is there you just have to subscribe this channel and write down in the comment section below if you like this channel thank you so much for helping uh, me to achieve all these things